Well, we've seen, and you've likely seen, properties that can only be described as eyesores all over the Grand Strand. And now, residents in Surfside Beach are complaining about seeing them in their neighborhoods, and the town is jumping into action. Our Ali Espinosa joins us live along Surfside Drive. So, Ali, what type of eyesores are folks upset about in particular down there? Well, Rachel, neighbors here say it's upsetting seeing others let go of their homes, but town staff say they're making good progress in cleaning them up. It just, it just needs to be cleaned up. It's just a mess. Surfside Beach residents like Missy Evermeyer take pride in keeping their homes clean and well kept. So when other neighbors don't do the same, Evermeyer says it's frustrating. Every day, all the stuff blowing out of the trees into our pool, into our yard. Other neighbors decided they've had enough, so much so they started to email Surfside Building and Zoning daily, complaining of several other houses like Evermeyer's neighbor. Surfside's a, a family beach, and you know, we like to take care of things here. I mean, you have a million dollar property right next door. <laughs> and, you know, it's just, it's upsetting. Town staff say they're currently addressing five to six nuisance homes in Surfside Beach, all of which have people living in them. Building and Zoning Director Heather Garrison says nuisance can be anything from junk cars to overgrown weeds. But both the town and residents want them taken care of. Yeah, you know, I just want Surfside to prosper and grow. I wish they would have them clean it up. I mean, you know, I mean, just they don't have to rebuild the house or anything like that, but. And that's exactly what the town says they're doing. They say they've made contact with all homeowners of these properties and say the community should see improvement very soon. Live in Surfside, Ali Espinosa, WMBF News.